Oh yeah, that's right, these guys are spawning. Great, this is gonna be a two-parter now. Uh, okay, well, we're gonna take down these pirates. In fact, I think this is the first time we're taking down the pirates as well, funny enough. Eh, oh well. <laughs> God diggity damn it. Alright, and a cutlass straight away. Okay, yeah, keep giving me all the wrong things, buddy. You know, that will make me feel much, much better, man. Let me tie it. Good lord. Alright, a discount card! Yeah? A actually, that's kind of cool. I like that, because it'll, it'll mean uh, cheaper reforges, right? <laughs> oh, right. Not bad, not bad. I'm trying to think, man. There needs to be... The Razor Pine would probably do a better job of taking down the Ice Queen than my uh, Razor Blade Typhoon. Uh, yeah, the Razor Blade Typhoon is uh, absolutely tanking my mana. So, yeah, we're going to have to buy a bunch more mana potions before we do the uh, the second Frost Moon. Which is going to be a thing. We're going to do a second Frost Moon inside of this session right here. Uh, a Pirate Staff! So we're pretty much getting every single thing from the Pirate Invasion, but nothing from anywhere else. We didn't get anything from the Pumpkin Moon. Not the Frost Moon, but we're getting everything from here, apparently. <laughs> that's, uh, that's pretty interesting. Obviously, the coin gun would be the ultimate thing to get, wouldn't it? I mean, obviously, we can't use it, but it would still be kind of cool. I have never, ever, ever had the coin gun in the entire time I've played Terraria. I have done nearly 200 total LP episodes on Terraria. And I've never, ever had the coin gun. It is ridiculous. I feel like it's time to get it, man. Don't know about you guys. <laughs> Good lord. Okay, just gotta keep going at this point now. Do 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 do. Hello, hi. How you all doing, friendos? Hopefully you're all good. Hmm. Look at all these pirate dudes. I think they could take me down. You just can't, buddy. You just can't. It'd be nice if I had a lucky coin. If we had a lucky coin, we could get more money real, real easy. Hello. <laughs> Look at that pirate captain. He's getting bombarded. Uh, another cutlass. Okay. Interesting. Another discount card. <laughs> What? This is probably the luckiest pirate invasion I've ever had. What the hell? This shouldn't even be a thing. I mean, yeah, it give me like a really lucky pirate invasion on my main LPs, but maybe not on this. Because, you know, this is kind of stupid. Yet another cutlass! <laughs> oh my god! This is ridiculous. I can't believe the amount of stuff we've got from that. That is absolute craziness. I mean, you know, I'm not going to complain, but we got all the wrong things. Oh, man, the pirate staff would be nice for a summoner playthrough, but obviously we can't use it. Hmm, interesting. Right, I'll tell you what, guys, what we're going to do next is we are going to do a massive selling session. Indeed, we're going to try and get as much money as we possibly can. We've got 92 gold coins at the moment, which is kind of cool. We've got a bunch of gold furniture as well. So let me go ahead and organize my inventory, and then we'll get on with the selling session. Alright guys, so here's all the things I have organised that are going to be sold. We've got quite the smorgasbord of stuff. We do have one of the discount cards in there as well, because obviously we don't need two. I imagine I'm going to sell a bunch of accessories uh, apart from this as well, because we have quite a lot of them. So without further ado, we already have some things we can start selling. So here we go, let's just start shift clicking them all in to uh, quickly sell them all. And as you can see, we're already starting to get a nice amount of money. Oh my god, look at all this stuff right here! Oh my god. God, this is ridiculous stuff. Uh, hey, hey, where you going? Come on, man. All right, let's loot all. Oh, my lord. I really hope I don't sell something by accident. So, here we go. Jewel hook, sniper rifle, arrows, nade launchers. Not bad. Shotguns, marrow, Venus Magnum, more shotguns. All this kind of crap. Look at all the stuff we have. It's just ridiculous. We don't need it all. We don't need it all. <laughs> It's just crazy the amount of stuff we've managed to obtain. It really is. Okay, and that's not even it. We still have a little bit more as well. Bada bing, bada boom. Hello. Okay, so boom, 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 boom. Right, I think that's it. I think that's everything. And the arrows. Don't need them. <laughs> right, so don't worry, guys. I have actually kept some of the more sort of epic things behind, just in case you guys want to have them in the map download. So don't worry your faces. Not everything has been sold, but I will, like I said, be selling a bunch of these accessories because a lot of them are dupes upon each other. So we don't need them. <laughs> so here we go. Look at how much money we have now. Three platinum and 85 gold coins. Very, very cool indeed. Right, okay. So that sun right there. Uh, I'm going to say I've got like... Five minutes, perhaps, to do a little bit of farming down in the underground hollow. 
Yeah, sounds right. Except when I get there, it'll probably be more like three and a half minutes, something like that. I don't know. Depends how quickly I can get there. Let's just bring up the old map really quick. Uh, yeah, that's actually really easy and quick to get to, isn't it? So, I don't know what I was on about with that. <laughs> what the hell was that? Something's giving weird sounds. I'm very confused right now. Oh boy. Right. Oh, hi. Hi. How you doing, buddy? Hi. hi. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's fine. That's fine. Hi. Okay. There's a bunch of guys over here, which I guess is kind of cool. Hello. You're dead. Right. Okay. So, we are going to go back into this little wee box here. We already have a blooming uh, thing in there. Look at this. <laughs> got a blooming mimic. Nice. <gasps> a toy sled? Oh my god, we've got a new pet! We've got the baby dino, and now we have a little baby snowman! <gasps> oh, that's so amazing! Oh, that is brilliant. That is brilliant. But, I think I still prefer my dino buddy, because it's so rare. Oh my god. Alright guys, we're gonna do a few minutes of uh, farming around here, and then I'll be back to do the second frost moon. Ooh, An icicle! That's pretty interesting. Not something I've had in quite a while, actually. <laughs> pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, let's head back to base. Uh, yep, once again, into sunset. Uh, let's go put this icicle in this chest here. Uh, we'll keep the sled on us just for the hell of it. <laughs> right, okay, let's just check what we have in terms of potions. We've got iron skin. I'm actually going to use them this time. Uh, what else have we got? Feather falling. Uh, I'll tell you what, regen potions will probably be a nice idea. Maybe magic power potions as well. So I believe we're going to need stars. Uh, bottles right here. I'm gonna need day bloom, mushrooms, and I believe some other things, but I can't remember quite how to do it. Right, okay, what can we make here? Uh, so yeah, that's the regen potions done. We've only got two of them because that's all I can really make. Uh, so let's go down to the guide. Where's the guide? Oh, he's up top. He's up top in my bedroom. Hey, buddy! <laughs> Just like old times, eh? Oh man. Okay, so magic power potion, we need deathweed and moon glow, which is awesome, and then mana regeneration. I don't think we're gonna need that because we're gonna be blooming surging through potions anyway. Right, so moon glow and deathweed. Moon glow, deathweed, moon glow, deathweed, moon glow, deathweed, there's the deathweed, and there's the moon glow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Magic power potions, 20% higher magic power. Awesome source. I'm a big fan of that. That is very cool. And it's used up some of our stars as well, which is quite cool as well. Right, okay. Uh, next thing, uh, let's go buy a bunch of potions from uh, this dude. Hello, hello. Please do give me a bunch of potions. That'll be very, very cool indeed. There we go, full stack, full stack. So we've got buffs, got mana potions, and we have epic weapons. So what I've actually decided to do is I actually decided to swap out my lightning boots for the celestial stone because I really, really like the celestial stone because it gives quite a nice amount of damage. As you can see, it does 107 with the accessory and then... It does a hundred without it, so it's a it's a nice little increase. I mean, every increase is a good increase. So yeah, that's basically what we're going to go for. And now we need to very very quickly get the blooming uh, end game stuff. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Give me that. Uh, five of these. Oh my god, I'm blooming dawdling around. I forgot. <laughs> I didn't even make the damn thing. Oh, I'm so stupid. All right, here we go. And okay, cool, 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 cool. <laughs> we got it in time. Okay, I'm a fan of that. That's good stuff. So, let's get back to the arena, and, uh, yeah, this is how we're gonna do it. It is now time, because obviously that star just fell down. Lols. Ah, oh, yee! Yeah. It's gonna be cool! I'm looking forward to it, my friends. I'm hoping we can get something cool this time. If not, then, uh, you know, Terraria can, like, go screw itself or something. <laughs> oh, man. Hello! Please get murked. There we go. Wave 2. Let's get back to the heat ray to do the, uh, the crowd control damage. Okay. Uh, the good thing is, these plumbing things here, the little... Uh, mimic things, they seem to progress you through the early waves really quickly. So if you find one, then by God, go ahead and kill it if you want to progress really quickly. I mean, look at this. We can just absolutely murk everybody like we have done. Already up to wave five, already have a tree, dude. There we go. Amazing. Amazing, 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 and amazing again. Oh, yeah. Okay. Come on, buddy. All right, let's try to use this thing. There we go. I want all the damage. All the damage. There we go. Absolute diddly squat still. At the moment, but I'm hoping that will change later on because that'd be very, very cool indeed. Okay, uh, we could potentially go back to this. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. All right, let's use this thing as well. And we haven't even been using our buffs. I'm such a dumbass. All right, how much does this do? 128? God damn! This does a stupid amount of damage now. Amazing. Okay, uh, still nothing. How much does my other things do? 148. What? I have never seen that high amount of damage from a magic weapon before. 
There's something going on here. <laughs> oh man, that's ridiculous stuff right there. 148 damage. That is absolute ridiculousness. It really is. Right, whatever the case, let's just keep going though. Just need to absolutely murk everybody still, because that's how you play the game. Uh, six, five, four, three, two, one, and he's dead. Sweet. Okay, still on the side of a razor pine. Come on, there's another one down there. Because it's kind of cool. There we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, dead. <laughs> it's so amazing how quickly I can take these guys down. It's brilliant. Oh, sand tank! Sand tank is among us. Oh boy, this is where things can get hairy. All right, or or not, you know. All of this is doing a nice amount of damage. Yeah, not bad, not bad. 5k, 4k, 3k. I think the reason why I didn't do that much damage to the Ice Queen before is because I was using my regenerative set. Which of course, you know, ooh, which kind of damages your ability to, you know, do cool things. Right, we're going to need to use a bit of this, a bit of regen. Just need to remember to get out of regen this time. Because that was kind of bad last time. I kind of left it, didn't I? So, yeah. Kind of my bad. Alright, let's switch back to offensive and let's keep murking these guys. So, yeah, this is pretty much how I'm going to do this thing. Hopefully we get some cool things. Uh, elf motor, that is a ranged flamethrower weapon. Kind of cool, but not entirely useful to our cause, let's be honest right here. Okay, oh god, there's a bunch of elf copters. <laughs> it's like some sort of conglomeration or something. Uh, there's another sand tank, I guess that's kind of cool. Hello, oh, kill the elf copter. Bunch of jerk bags. Alright, uh, should we try and use this, maybe? I mean, eh, eh, he does a lot of damage to me, he really does. Oh, I I don't know, man. I'm playing with fire, aren't I? I really am. Good lord. I'm hoping we don't get another Bloomin' Event spawn on the morning, like a Bloomin' Solo Eclipse. If we had three Solo Eclipses in one series, that would be, like, beyond weird. It's bad enough me having two. <laughs> oh, man. In a short amount of space of time as well, which is kind of funny. Alright, okay. Oh, boy. Just be careful, Python. Be careful, buddy. Just be careful. Alright, that's the tree dude down. I still can't see any razor pines, unfortunately. Uh, let's be careful. Okay, there's another one of them guys. They drop loads of hearts, which is kind of cool. Still can't see any other weapons, unfortunately, which is really bad, because I really, really want some. Alright, maybe we can use this for a little while. Come on. All the damage. Alright, he's dead. Sweet. Okay, and I'm running a wee bit low on health, but that should be no problem. Yeah, I feel like regening your health in the Fossman is actually fairly easy. I mean, you get the little mimics, they give you a bunch of hearts, and then obviously you've got these, like, weak-ass bosses here. Well, this one's pretty weak anyway. Look at him, I could just murk him in a matter of seconds. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it's brilliant, I love it. Hello, just need to be careful of the spiky balls, they do a lot of damage. And those blooming flying present things. You would think they're nice, wouldn't you? You would think they're nice because they're presents, but no. No, Terraria doesn't do giving us nice presents. No. Well, apart from 1.3, obviously, because, uh, you know, that's going out pretty soon, isn't it? That was confirmed release date of June the 30th, which is kind of awesome. For those of you guys who don't already know. Okay. Two dude down. <gasps> I see a Razor Pine! I want it, I want it, I want it. Razor Pine! Yes! We got it! <laughs> oh my god! We finally got a Razor Pine! Oh, this is absolutely brilliant! Okay, uh, what kind is it? It's a hurtful one. Okay, I'm gonna try and rejig my weapons a little bit. Oh, this is amazing. This is where the damage comes in. There we go. 27 quid, 26, 25, 24. Yep. Just, yep. There we go. Oh my god. My life is complete. For those of you guys who don't know, the Razor Pine is one of my all-time favorite weapons in Terraria. It really is. It does a stupid amount of damage per second, it really does. Oh boy, gotta be careful though. I don't have a great deal of uh, health left. Like a couple of crits and I could be out the game. I could do with getting back on the ground maybe. Okay, get back on the ground. Oh, flockos. Oh god. G caught. Ooh, that actually got kind of close right there. Good lord. Hello. Oh, there she is. Is that a new one or a different one? Oh no, it's the same one. Okay, I should be able to kill her in which case. Was that the sound of her dying? So, she makes sort of a male sound when she dies. What kind of thing is that? Oh, a North Pole! Holy crap! <laughs> this episode has been nothing but luck so far. This is a complete turnaround on the last episode. Good lord! 
Okay. Uh, obviously, like, the ultimate icing on the cake would be to get the good old-fashioned, uh, what's it, what's it I'm looking for? The good old-fashioned blizzard staff. That would be amazing. And then after that, the only thing I really want to farm out would be the, uh, Bash Scepter. And then that would be it for the series. Oh my god. That's amazing. Wave 12! Fantastic. Alright. We could really do with some more Ice Queen spawning, potentially. Uh, oh, oh, speak of the devil. There she is. Hello. Right, okay. Where is she? Where is she? Hello. Hi. Hi. How you doing? Hi. Hi, 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 hi. Damage galore. I love it. I love it. I love it. But you need to be careful of her attacks. Where's the moon at right now? About three quarters of the way through, so I'd say there's about two minutes left of this thing. Should be able to take it down, right? Shouldn't be that difficult, especially with the offensive set of armor. You know, 12k, 11k, yeah. Nice damage right there. And of course health. So we're nearly at full health again, which is awesome. Alright, she's almost dead. Come on, Blizzard Staff. Gonna be nice. No sign. Alright, no Blizzard Staff. Maybe we could take down this gal as well. I can't believe these guys have 34,000 health. That's ridiculous, isn't it? It really is. It's like a proper boss within... Another big sort of boss event. It's ridiculous. I wonder how much health the blooming Martian dudes are gonna have in the Martian event on 1.3. Oh man, it's gonna be craziness. All right, come on. The moon is almost down at this point. I could do with killing you and potentially getting something cool. Uh, I could also do with some health. As in for real. Uh, yeah, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Not looking good. Not looking good. Got no health down here. Oh god. Come on. Oh, I think that's her dead. Okay, cool. Right. Uh, there should be some health around here. Yep, yeah, there is. Ooh. Oh, bunch of health. Cool, 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 cool. Woo oh, man. Okay, right. Is there even a slight chance we'll be able to take her down? Is there a slight chance? She's at 24 and health. Get out of my face. I don't like it when she's in my face. It's really quite bad, actually. Right, okay. I think we might not be able to do this. I'm not going to lie. I don't have much high hopes for this. Come on. I don't know, man. 7k? 7k? Ah, oh, it just changed. God damn it. Oh well. I don't think we did too bad on that one. Uh, now, where did the other ice queen die? I generally don't know. Where did the other ice queen die? Surely it isn't this far out. No, I've got a strong feeling it isn't. <laughs> Unless it is. I don't know. Was there something over there? Here's some coins. Gel? I don't know. Maybe I killed some stuff earlier and got some stuff. I don't know, potentially. Um, not bad. Not bad. I kind of neglected to use my magic power potions again, though. I should really, really get on that, shouldn't I? Oh, man. Me forgetting things is probably going to be the death of me. But, uh, yeah. In all seriousness, we did not do that bad with that event right there. We got the Elf Mounter and the North Pole. Of course, they're not really useful to our cause. And, of course, we got the Big Daddy, the uh, the Razor Pine. Awesome source. Uh, I tell you what, to end the episode, we're going to go ahead and uh, reforge it. Hmm, because I think we might be able to get something cool. Don't know about you guys. Oh, let's just switch that really quick, just so we've got a bit of speed. Speed is amazing. Right, okay. And quick stack for Platinum. Amazing. Oh, Nob! Hello! You're gonna have a bunch more of my money, aren't you? Mm. Deranged. My dog is barking outside, which is great. Uh, no, I don't want less damage. I want mythical or something. Come on! Masterful is good! Uses three mana. Mythical would be better again. I don't know, man. These things are good. They're very, very good. <laughs> right. Alright guys, I think on that note though, it is time to end this episode and indeed the session right here. Thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy the episodes, and of course you're excited to see more, uh, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And of course you can subscribe if you want to know when the future videos are out. But that is going to wrap it up for today my friends. Thank you very much for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and I shall see you guys in the next episode.